Hi boys and girls, today we are going to be learning about counting objects up to 20. Before we start counting objects, let's go ahead and count out loud together. Let's say the numbers. Ready? Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Nice job. So that's how we count out loud. Now let's talk about counting objects. When we count objects, we're always going to start with the number one. We want to make sure that as we are counting, we are counting slowly and carefully. So we have to make sure that we take our time. And we have to make sure also that we are pointing to objects as we count them. When we are taking our times and going slowly and pointing to each object, that helps to make sure that we don't accidentally skip any objects when we're counting. We also want to make sure that we say each number name in order while we are counting the objects. So we want to make sure that as we count, we count in number order. Let's go ahead and practice all of that with the toy trucks. So we're going to start with the first truck. I'm gonna use my pointer to point and you can point with your finger to the screen as we count together. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice job. We have ten toy trucks. Good work taking your time and pointing to the objects as you count them. Now we also want to make sure that when we're counting, that we only count each object just one time. So we don't want to accidentally count an object two times. Now this can be a little bit tricky, especially when objects are arranged in a circle like this. When objects are in a circle, it could be pretty easy for us to start at the top and count all the way around the circle. And then when we get back up to the top, we might accidentally count that first truck two times. So that is why I have decided to draw a line through my first truck. That will help me remember where I started counting. And when I get around the circle and I start heading back up towards the top, I'll remember when I see the truck that has the line that I should not count it again because I already counted it. Let's go ahead and try this together. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six. So we have six trucks in our circle and nice job remembering to stop and not counting that first truck twice. We only count it one time. We can also write a number to show how many objects there are. So in our last example, we found out that there were six trucks in our circle. So I went ahead and wrote a number six to show how many trucks there are. Let's go ahead and count to see how many teddy bears we have. Let's try to remember all of the counting rules that we just talked about. We're going to start with the number one. We will point to each object as we count. We will take our time and we will also make sure that we say our numbers in order and make sure we don't skip any numbers as we're counting or any objects. Let's go ahead and get started and you can point with your finger again. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20. Whoa, that was a lot of teddy bears. Nice job, boys and girls. So we can now see that we have 20 teddy bears on our page. Great work following those rules of counting. And boys and girls, you are now ready to move on to the choice board activity.